And we back. Y'all asked me to do some of these goofy long form film sessions, so I'm going to be doing that. Uh, not too much because y'all don't tell me what to do. But uh, I think <laughs> I think we can do this every now and then. Neville Galmore, defensive tackle from Oklahoma. He's number 90. Uh, my quick summary of him, because I have watched film on him before. I'm just doing this video for y'all, you know, like, you know, for the views. <laughs> but, uh, hey, man, I wish he would use his power a little bit in the right spots, and he would use his quickness sometime in the right spots. And I wish he was a little more consistent with getting people up off him. And if he did those things properly, he'll be a top 15 pick, man. That's real talk. But sometimes he just disappears and he can't get off blocks. Sometimes his quickness to get him out the place. Sometimes he's not using power properly. But uh, that's for y'all to, you know, take looks at when y'all watch film on your own. But in terms of him moving, moving, movement, he put the nipple on the titty moving. Like as a big guy moving around, he's number 90. As a big guy just moving around, being quick, being, you know, ball get off size and all that. Gap exchanges or whatever. Oklahoma, I think they did a little too much gap exchanging, you know, stunting, slanting, and moving. I think they did a bit too much of that in my, you know, for my personal taste, but that's just my own personal philosophy or whatever. But um, you have a mover in Neville Gallimore. You got a mover. And, hey, there you go. Let's <laughs> – Let's see, boom, 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 they're going to, they're running counter fronts. I hate this. So they're running counter to the left, but they're going to hand it off to the right. I got you, but Neville Galmore was able to get down the line of scrimmage and make the play. Good play. I hate that. <laughs> I, hate, I hate misdirection that we letting. Like, if 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 we're going to misdirect, find a way to, bl to block the guys that we letting go. Um, but, you know, whatever, man. This is not my thing. I, I don't care. Uh, he's not on the field. He's number 90, so here we go. What about this play? Let's see, let's see, let's see. Yeah. And, you know, <clears throat> it's another thing, too. Like, I don't know what they teaching these guys necessarily, so it's not really my place, <laughs> my place to say. But uh, if you're going to start off in B gap, but you're going to get, you're going to end up all the way into the backside, the backside A gap. Uh, yeah. I don't know, but it could be something that they're teaching them to do, so I ain't going to hate on it too much. Um, but Neville Galmore, man, speed, quickness, ball get off. I think there's absolutely a place for him in the National Football League. He may need to be a guy that has to, like, that needs to, like, develop one year. You know, just uh, teaching and power and things like that, and he'll be fine. And you can take a look at his senior bowl tape, too. That's Galmore there. You can, you can, um, you can take a look at his, at his, um, senior bowl tape too and what you see from him and all that's on my channel by the way uh what you can see from him is that he's beating the hell out of people with speed or, or his quickness or whatever but when it's time to use power or it's time to use the correct kind of rush against a a certain type of guy then you'll see him kind of get blocked there but you know that just is what that is they running it and it, yeah see they just they doing a lot of movement here. I hate it. <laughs> Quit moving so much. Like just let Neville Galmore rush up a gap so we can get a good idea of what he can do. But they're gonna gap exchange with him and you know, Baylor's gonna pick it up again. That just is what that is. But uh hey man, who am I? I'm just a YouTuber. He's lined up at zero right now. Hmm. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah. Yeah. Nothing there, nothing there. Let's see. He's in uh, a gap to your right, right there. Uh, he jumps over to the left a gap. So, hmm. you know, it seems like it seems like Baylor knew that they was gonna come out gap exchanging and moving guys around, and that they are somehow blocking into that. <laughs> Not blocking away from it, but they're blocking into the gap exchanges, and they're just going under it. Like if everybody, like if everybody on the Oklahoma defense is slanting to our right, that's the offensive right. This point of view here, if they're gonna slant to our right, then let's just block it and run left and go under it. <laughs> you see what I mean? <laughs> let's just go under. It. That's the oldest trick in the book. It's not the, the oldest trick, but. It's been around for a while. Hey, man, you want to move? Cool. We'll just run you the way you want to go, and we'll just go the opposite way and go under it. They did that a lot, and it's and it's hard to get a look for Neville Galmore there because he never stays in, in the damn gap that he starts in. It's kind of hard to evaluate him, but you got to do what you got to do. And I see what they're doing for the greater good. Like, they're going to they gonna slant right here, boom, but they want this, this blitzer to run free. I get it. But Galmore is, is is one of your weapons, so just let him 
either rush from A gap or, or you know, rush B gap or whatever, you know? Who who got to handle the football here? Gallimore? Good play. Good play, Neville. Boom, 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 come across. Ah. Fantastic. Fantastic. But you just gotta weed through these looks though, man. You know, you you that there, there's 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 gonna be a lot of um gap exchanges, a lot of exotic movements or whatever, man. But you just kinda gotta dig through that and find just quality plays to evaluate. Um they're gonna do another gap exchange here, but that's not as bad. Good effort there from Neville Gatmore. We can always use a lot more effort. We can always use a lot more effort. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Let me go back and see. Can I evaluate? Not really. But we get the movement though. We but we are getting an idea of his movement. This would be a good time to see his power. What's the down and distance here? What's the let's see. Third and no, it's first and ten. It's first and ten. All right, cool. Why does it look like a quarterback sneak? <laughs> why why they line up and do this? It looks like first and ten. I'm confused. Okay, whatever. But, uh, yeah, Neville Gallimore is in B-gap. And you know what's so funny about it? If it's first and ten and they quarterback sneak, ain't nobody in A-gap. <laughs> so, whatever. <laughs> Fine. Moving on. Uh, get, 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 get out of here. Neville is not on the field. Keep going. All right, he's in your left B-gap here. Stunning around, stunning around. Well, Oklahoma defense probably be so. You know, what if Oklahoma defense was, like, great this whole time? Because they got some pro guys on this defense. But, like, what if they were just fantastic, but just the the their exoticness kind of, you know, get them out of position or whatever? Like, like what if, what if, what if that was a real thing? I don't know. I hate it. But, boom, 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 swim. That's cool, but... <clears throat> Make the play though. Never got more is at zero. I don't like him at zero. Uh let's see, let's see, let's see. Move forward. Go forward, Never Galmore. Go forward. And you really gotta put your hey, hey, everybody. Put your put your talent evaluator hat on. Put your scout hat on. Cause you need it. You needed to weed through all of this. That's why this is really a hard breakdown. And I tell you what, like this is why Senior Bowl is so fantastic because you get to see guys out of the element. You know, all they did was just run slants this whole this mostly this this whole first half I saw. They just ran gap exchanges, slants, and movements, and I got tired and cut it off. I got tired and cut it off. But you know, if you watch more film and dig through it, and you watch what the Senior Bowl tapes had, and you'll 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 have a better idea for Neville Gallimore. <clears throat> but um, a lot of times you'll see Neville kind of rushing without a plan, or not really having a good idea of what to do with his hands. You know what I mean? You see a lot of stuff like that. But you see the the physical ability, though. You see Neville Gallimore's physical ability. You just gotta. You just got to get through the scheme, player. It's fantastic here. And here's, and that's part of my problem, right? Sometimes he's terrible with his hands. Other times, you know, he's swimming properly. Over the top, boom, boom, boom. I need you to find the football, though. I need you to swim. You're getting pushed in the back. I can't hate you for getting pushed in the back, Neville. I can't. Hey, good effort, though. Did you end up making the, making the play anyway? Did you came, you came back? You came back? I like his effort, though. I can't hate that. I like Neville Gallimore's effort. He's at zero. Line up over the center. On the ground. Get up. A-gap uh, on the left side here. Our left. Our point of view left. Yeah, he's one of those guys that, that kind of gets blocked and stays blocked. Um, it's a couple other guys like that. Like Marlon Davidson is like that. Um, uh, what's my man from North Carolina? Also in the senior bowl. He's another guy that kind of beats you off the rip. And if you don't beat him off the rip, they kind of just hang on to you. Yeah, man. They they don't really have plans after what happened to him when you first catch him. You know, one of those guys, man. So, yeah, man, just got more. Just need a little bit of coaching, a little bit of tuning up. But the ability's there. The ability's there. Like, this spin move was very ill-advised. Well, I, I ain't... <laughs> 
<laughs> that's a very ill-advised spin move there. But somebody's going to get hands on him and just, you know, trim the fat a little bit. Trim the fat. Speaking of, speaking of trimming the fat, he, you know, combine nerds. Tell me how much he weigh compared to how much Derrick Brown weigh compared to Javon Kinlaw weigh. He's not a husky-looking big dude or a super fat husky-looking big dude. Derrick Brown is. <laughs> Let's see what he does here. He's lined up to the he's in he's lined up in B gap to the left, or he's a three tech to the left. He's more uh more shaded onto that guard, but you see the effort. You will see that. You'll see the effort. And you know what? If you're Oklahoma's defense coordinator and you're saying, you know what, I think my players is bad. <laughs> so we just gonna have to scheme our way in the sacks, and I don't hate that, but I don't think your players are bad. I think you got a first round linebacker potentially and a day two possibly defensive tackle on your team. Uh and a couple other guys spread out. You know, some some guys are gonna come out next year. So you got talent on your on your defense. You ain't gotta you ain't gotta hold your guys out like that. Mm. Now if a guy more is gonna be in the B gap to our right. Let's take a look and see what your boy's doing, man. Let's just take a look at Neville Guy more and see what he's doing. That's what I want Neville Gallimore to do. I want Neville Gallimore to be in one gap, stay there, and just go. But then they, they they trying to get cute with the end here. Stop getting cute with the end. Let them guys rush, man. Let them guys rush. Boom, boom, boom. I think Neville Gallimore kind of ran free because 61 kind of let him go to go block seven. That's more, that's more scheme pressure. I don't want scheme pressure. I don't want to see what Neville Gallimore could do. <clears throat> on his own, actually. But like I said, check out my senior ball video. It's a pretty good one. It's a good one. I want to see Neville get off these blocks here. He will get stuck on blocks. Get off that block, man. Come on, son. Get off that block. Unless he beats the block off the rip. Now, when he beats the block off the rip, he's good. But if he gets onto the block, he's stuck. He's stuck. <laughs> Boy, Oklahoma. <laughs> Let me see. There's Oklahoma trying to do all that creative shit, and they got 31 points on the board. Baylor got 31 points on the board. <laughs> Boy, all that damn scheming you doing on defense ain't getting no sacks on nobody, on, on nobody game log. Just It's a screen, so they let Neville go on purpose, did they? Yeah, they kind of just let Neville go. I don't know, though. I don't think 55 is the best actor in the world. It's a screen, whatever. Fifty five just <laughs> just wasn't running the screen well. Uh, Galmore not on the field. Uh, not on the field. Uh, Neville Galmore there. He's uh, B gap to the right side. Let's take a look. And see, let's see what we got here. Boom, boom, boom. <sighs> see Neville. I don't mind this though, but when you come off the board and you swim, stay tight to the dude you just beat. You know what I'm saying? Um, take note, young pass rushers or whatever. Like if you beat somebody, stay tight to them. For one, if you beat them, they can't recover and beat you because you beat them. Two, if you don't stay tight, you end up running into somebody else and somebody else will block you. Like Neville allowed this center to block him. Right. But if he would come off the ball, boom, swim with his quickness, beat this guard. If he stayed, if he stays tight to this guard, he just has a free path to the quarterback here. But instead, he runs himself into the center. So, you know, should he have a little more control? Possibly. But you know how that go. You know how that go. Um, not on the field. Uh, I know he's on the field now. Let's see. Never got more B gap to the left. Let's see. Let's see. Yeah, you just kind of got. Yeah, disengage. Get him off of you, Never got more. I like your physical traits, though, my guy. You just got to get him up off of you. A little bit of polish, you'll be fine, sir. A little bit of polish, and you'll be fine. Is this another example of you needing to be tighter? 61 wasn't even looking at you. <laughs> Uh, I don't hate it, Nova. They may be coaching you up to do some nonsense. Boy, you're going to go to a coach in the league, and they're just going to be like, hey, man, just bust ass upfield and do your thing. They're going to be like, you really mean it, coach? I'm like, yep. Just bust ass and do your thing, Neville. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 
yeah, moving on. Uh, I want to see if I got another Oklahoma film. So y'all give me 30 seconds to look and figure that out. A- after this play, let's see. After this play... All right, cool. Be right back. Let me go see if I got some Oklahoma film. The YouTube Illuminati is taking money away from your favorite content creators, and people often ask the best way to support the channel directly. I tell them that subscribing on my Patreon. Just $1 a month would increase production and the frequency of uploads. Basically, that means more content for you. For less than a bag of almond M&Ms, you can support the channel, call dibs on requests for future videos, and you can have access to Patreon-exclusive material like my throwback film sessions. That's patreon.com slash Vach Lombardi. I appreciate the support. Doski Woski. Salute. I got some Texas Tech. A little something, something. Not too, too much. Got a little something, something. Neville Galmore is in B gap to our right. Let's see. Much of the same. Get up, Phil. Be aggressive, my guy. Uh, let's see. He's at he's at nose right now. He's at, he's 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 number ninety, and I'm finding him pretty easy. So <laughs> I just want y'all to find him easy too. He's at zero. Let's see. <clears throat> Uh, da, 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 da. Hey, pick a side, pick a side player. You know, don't go in one a gap just to end up in another a gap. Hey, pick that gap and bust. But like I said, I don't know what they coach, so whatever. Uh, hey, ah, shit, double. Hey, if y'all watch my film and I talk about pass rush enough, I always say disengage with these guys. I always say defeat the hands, get guys off of you. So Neville Galmore is going to come off the football. He's lined up over the center. He's going to bow. This is kind of his way of pulling cloth, but he's just going to, hey, just redirect you, boom, boom, boom. Defeat that hand, Neville Galmore. I talk about this all the time. People get tired of me saying it all, uh, just over and over again. Defeat that hand and get that damn dude off of you because if you don't, he going to hold you and, you know, the referee can't even see his hands right there. He just look beat. But if you get that dude's hands off you, you probably get to the quarterback a little quicker or you'll probably get, you know, a little more more pressure on him or whatever. But ah, defeat them hands, Neville Galmore. Defeat them hands. Damn, Carl Lewis. Was that the referee calling holding? Was that? Was that the referee calling holding? My bad. What was that? I, the, the, who knows? <laughs> who knows? Let's see. Da, 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 B gap. He's in the B gap to the left here. Mm, they still gap exchanging, and he's gonna get into a block. He just held up there. I'm glad I. Can, I'm, I'm glad I'm able to see through Neville, though, man. I'm I'm able to see through his flaws. Cause I feel like I can coach him. That could just be my ego, though. I just feel like I can coach him. Too much moving. You never got settled. You got blocked. I understand. Neville's at zero. Are they trapping you? Why the center just let you go? Why the center let you go like that? Uh, and the running back came to pick you up. Okay, the center was just <laughs> – center just made a oopsie. Senator just, Senator just said, I'm going to let Neville Galmore run free. Uh, let's see. Let's keep moving. I'm going to sneeze at some point, but I'm going to cut my mic off before I do it, I promise. So if it goes silent at any time, that's just me sneezing. Don't panic. Don't go nowhere. Everything's good. Good money here. Neville Galmore, number 90, lined up over the, over the, uh, over the center at zero. Check out these splits, man. Texas Tech got a, got some wide splits out here, man. They just come, come, come rush our passer, they say. Sack our quarterback, they say. Mm. Anyway. We ain't watching film on you, buddy. But, oh, boy. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. Oh, they run a screen on the on the on the front side. Hey, hey, man, look if you look if they run a screen on front side, bro, you can't get whooped like that backside. I'm sorry, backside tackle. You can't do that. Mm-mm. That's bad for business. That's not good for nobody's soul, player. Um, ninety, ninety, ninety. Boy, I know I just got to sneeze. I know it's on the way. I ain't do it yet. It's coming. Just. I just feel it. Mm. Never get hurt or something. What, what, what's going on with him? <clears throat> what's going on with him? He 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 couldn't be on the field this drive. His foot hurt. Wait, that was him. Was that him? Was that him? Uh, nah, that's like ninety six. Hey man, maybe Never got a long break here. I don't know, but maybe I'll take this time to talk a little bit about Neville Galmore. Um. Never mind. He's back on the field. He's uh, 
uh, B gap to the right here. Pardon me, he's zero now. Whoever's the defense coordinator for Oklahoma, I hate them. Chat boss, could y'all please Google defense coordinator for Oklahoma and tell me who he is so I can officially go in the chat box and say I hate that person or just go in the you know comment section and say I hate him. I just need Galmore to be a little more polished as a D lineman. And that's okay. A lot of guys aren't polished on this level at D line. They just kind of get away with that, with athleticism and whatever scheme they in is just the scheme that they in. Uh, 73 going to drive you. You come, he going he, he gonna kind of walk with you and you know, you just kind of went with him. But um, <clears throat> I, I just don't think that this scheme helped Nova Galmore a lot, but I do think Galmore has the ability to, to be good enough. I think he can be good enough, man. I just need him to know when to be strong, how to get people to hell up off of him. A little polish will help, defeating the hands, things like that. But will somebody draft him off athleticism alone? Indubitably. 10,000%, Mr. Wolf. Somebody going to draft his ass just because he's big and quick. And they're going to teach him. They're going to they gonna, they gonna teach him the game. And that's okay. That's okay. Got more one tech. Cool. Not bad. I feel like he lost a little bit of weight, too, but... I don't know. Maybe I was bugging. Pretty good play right here. He's just going to ride, 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 find the football. <clears throat> Got you off up now. Got the blocker off up now. We're going to watch like five more plays and another guy more that we're going to move on with our good old lives. Okay. Hey, man, y'all can't be out here chop blocking, man. Oh, y'all can't. Oh, the referee just, oh, the referee saw it. Wait a minute. <laughs> wait, wait a minute. Let me move this. Oh, God. Can I move this? Wait a minute. Let me just move this a little bit. Y'all see the referee at the bottom left? Him, sir. <laughs> Officer 79 did it. Ah. That's the chop block, fam. You can't be out here chopping and hitting folk. What are you doing? Officer, it was him. Level guy more is at the one tech to our right. Let's see what he does. Get double team. That don't count. Uh, one tech to our left. Tick, 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 tick. I like his effort, man. He be running. Guy more be running. And Oklahoma beating the hell out of Texas Tech. Yeah, we're going to watch like three more plays and we're going to get up out of here. Three more plays and we're going to get up out of here. Never got more versus the run. Ain't terrible. I don't hate it. Boom, he's going to engage with, with 58. Now, this ain't a bad time. I, I don't mind people like not engaging, not disengaging here. Like, if you want to engage 58, stay engaged and just find the football. Cool. Just get off at some point. And when you get off, you know, get into play. I don't mind that at all. Good play, Galmore. Two more. Two more Galmore plays and I'm leaving. I don't know what tarnation happened right here. But Galmore, he, he, he ain't on the field. So y'all can y'all Google and see what happened. But mm, you can watch this on your own. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. The Galmore's not there. But they take Neville Galmore off the field for long ass periods of time, boy. They're trying to get their play. Galmore's at the zero here. Let's see what happens. Some aggression. Gotcha, Neville Galmore. Just kind of got washed out the play here. Hey, in these situations, Neville Galmore, just kind of hold your ground and find the football right there. I know you want to beat the hell out of this dude, but just hold your ground and find the football. That's okay. Hold your ground and find the football. Don't don't get washed out to play. That's all. And, and that goes back to polish. That, that that goes back to polish. Just just kind of clean his game up a little bit. And you'll be good to go. Clean the game up just a wee bit. <clears throat> you know. Um, I bet if Neville got more play for a team and just let him get upfield and bust ass, just let him line up and be gap and just be quick and bust ass upfield. Oh, I bet Neville got more. Oh, Neville got more. Be so fantastic. And uh, he can go to a uh, to a sword fighting trainer. What the hell, uh, Aaron Donald do? Fight swords and knives and shit. <laughs> Teach Neville got more all that and just keep him in the weight room, man. Got more. Be fine. Got more. Be fine. Where do you uh where do you pick them? I know a lot of people are gonna ask that in the chat box. I mean, I don't know. Uh second round, maybe, early second. Mm -hmm. Some teams like like guys so much they take them late first, you know, who knows? Uh LJ Collier was a guy that ended up being a late first guy. Never got more in the left A gap. Let's see what happens. Um not saying LJ Collier shouldn't have went uh first round, but 
Yeah, LJ Carr, you probably shouldn't have went first round, but <laughs> whatever. Um, blocked by seventy three. Hey man, I want y'all to terrorize Texas Tech, man. I, I'm just, I'm sorry, Oklahoma. I just wanted y'all to terrorize Texas Tech. Last play we're gonna watch here. Neville Gallimore lined up at uh, zero. He's over the center. Let's see what's happening here. <sighs> They're moving him around. He's in B gap to the left. I see why Oklahoma bad on defense. But you know, the more the more film you watch, you just see why people struggle. You just see it. <laughs> that play don't count. <laughs> Let's watch one more guy, one more play that counts, man. Let's see what happens here. Okay, maybe not there. Let's see what happens here. Okay. Galmore is gonna be he's gonna shade the center, but for the most part, like to the to his left, uh A gap there. Cross face, another gap exchange. Yeah, Oklahoma pissing me off. All right, y'all. I appreciate y'all for tuning in. This was fun. This was a long one. Uh, there'll probably be more long ones, but not as many as y'all think. Cause y'all don't tell me what to do. Uh, I really want to pump a lot of content out, man. It's draft. It's, it's draft season, man. This is my time of year. Um, you know, and I've been out the game for a while doing cowboy stuff. So I just want to feed the block as much as I can. So y'all hold it down for the Doski Woski. Until next time, man. Follow me on Twitter: V O C H L O M B A R D I. Peace, y'all.